Hey everybody, this is Michael with Monkey Does Outdoors, and I'm out here at Greenbelt Lake. And one thing I've been wanting to do, and I haven't done it in a while, is do some more cooking. And I'm just going to do a, a little bit of cooking here, and I'm going to put this in my regular video. Cause this is something I spent the pandemic with my folks, and we'd go get my aunt, and I've made different things in the Instant Pot a lot of times. This is my Instant Pot Mini, by the way, for those of you who don't know. I've had this since I started, since I was, for, for a while now. But I didn't use it as much until the pandemic. Then I came up with a few other things that I haven't done before that really worked out well. And so I'm going to show you what I've done. And then if you want to, you can do the same thing. I mean, it's it's pretty simple. Um, I'm going to adjust this camera a little bit. But anyway, right here, I have some chicken thighs. And I like chicken thighs because uh, they don't dry out so much. They they take on flavor real well, and and they're just I like they're easier to cook with in my opinion, and they you still get high protein, low fat, and it's good stuff. The first thing I do with them though is I like to salt and pepper the both sides of them a little bit, and I like this I use one of these kind of grinders, it's a sea salt grinder, and I have a pepper grinder. As you can see, it's just a black pepper grinder. Sometimes I've used the the ones that have the multi kind of different kinds of peppercorn, but this one is as good as anything. You can sit on and do both sides, you know, do that side and flip it over, do the other side. Sometimes with, with beef or something like that, I'll do this a little bit ahead of time, and it actually makes a big difference. The chicken, I just do it right before I use it because you got to be careful about, you know, handling chicken too much. But I'll do that, and then what I do is I place them in, in the instant pot, do that trash, and then what I like to do is I use a measuring cup and I'll put a quarter cup of this this is this is what I use I used to make my own a long time ago but this is just pretty close to what I used to make and so that's what I use it's a sweet baby rays this is a gourmet barbecue sauce but uh I like it I discovered it when I was traveling and it works out pretty good and I haven't even opened this one yet so let's see if we can get this thing open yep well I just use about a quarter cup of this and then and I'll keep this out because I'll put some on as a meat in it as well but then I use a little just plain old apple juice I mean this apple juice is just regular I get it from the store it was I guess I got a name brand it doesn't have to be a name brand so what you can get it doesn't take much of it so if you don't like drinking it make sure you get a little teeny bottle of it but I like to drink it I don't do it very often but I do I do like drinking and so drinking it what I'll do first though is I'm gonna go ahead and dump the what I can of this barbecue sauce in there and that's why I got one of these spoons it's just easier to scrape it all out in there Then I will put about the same amount, a quarter cup of apple juice in there. And it's really, you know, these instant pots require moisture. That is all the moisture you need right there. That'll, that'll do it's everything we want it to do. And I'll go ahead and plug it in at this point. It'll come on. What I do is you, you get it ready, and I put it on on um, pressure cook. You want it on high, and this is already set nine minutes of what I want it to do. So I push, I just let it, let it start, and there it goes. And so we'll be back in nine minutes.
I'm gonna turn this off, and that'll actually uh, hit cancel. That's off, and that'll actually speed up the 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 steam or pressure reduction in without before I have to release it there. And now I like to put a towel over it because I don't like the steam going all everywhere. But especially when it's next to television in a camper, you don't have a whole lot of space to go put it elsewhere. But you gotta release the pressure, and so. It's been sitting here for a little bit, so it might be pretty good, but we'll see. It is, see. But I like to do that with a towel just in case, because you just never know. But then the instant pot makes it easy. You can do that and be careful. Stuff's going to drip a little. And let it drip, and then you you can then make it where you can put the the pot like that. I mean, handle lid. Get it right at some, some point. Put the lid like that, and then I like to, I like to And now what we can do is I use one of these and go in and get, get one. Actually, I may get two of them. The two smaller ones. You know, and if you want to. You can get a spoon and dip a little of that sauce off on you on it. Now I'll make myself a little thing here to set the tongs on, but you can get a spoon of some sort if you want to. And I I like to just use well, we'll use some of that. I'll get a spoon. And dip a little dab of it off. But I also probably might put a little, a little of that sweet baby rays on top of it. But anyway, that's how it looks when it's done, and that is good stuff. I promise you. I've tried it many times, and my aunt and uncle, mom and dad, I mean my aunt, and my mom and dad have all had it, and we all like it. But that's my version of instant pot barbecue chicken. Quick, easy, and no fuss, in my opinion. <laughs> but thanks for watching. If you if you like this, let me know, and I'll work. I'm when I'm actually going to work on some more stuff. I've got a really, really neat thing that I'm going to do. But it has to be done outside, and I have to have a place that doesn't have a burn bin, you know, because I use charcoal. But it's something that you're going to like to see, especially if you travel or if you do much camping, and like this, it doesn't have an oven. That'll it'll take care of your problem of not having an oven if you if you have the, a good place to use it. But I'll, I'll show you that it's coming as soon as I can get get the space to do it. But anyway, thank you. Please hit the like and subscribe button. Thank you.